right, well, there you have it. It's been quite the journey, but the M3 diff is in. The whole rear end is in. The drive shaft is done. And we're having fun. <laughs> Well, it might look like there's water up to my door, and, uh, yeah, you might be right, because I'm fucking flooding over here. So, sick, I just drove into a place, and my engine shut off, and here I am on the side of the road, filling up with water. Fucking sick, dude. Fucking sick. Look at that. Floating in water. Nice. Awesome. Love my life. Going on a nice, nice cruise. Maybe I'll get a fish for back here. I can just have him swim around. Feeding him every once in a while. That's pretty good. It's not bad. You know. Well, other boaters flying by. That's good. Oh, there he goes. Nice. Sweet.
Look at that. These tires are brand eye. It's so rusty. Rust. Wow. Hmm. Hey, at least the coils aren't rusty. But they're gonna be oh, as soon yeah. as I take it out on the street. Eat. Is there any way? Philip! <laughs> Fuck. It's not the right weather to clean this shit outside. I know. Oh, dude, that's not. Oh, God, it looks like throw up. Oh. Oatmeal. What's the diagnosis? Uh, so. You got a little water in your engine here. I don't know if you uh, can see that. Kind of hard to see. Kind of like puddles <laughs> or something. And uh, yeah, some nuts. Some nuts also found their way into there. I don't know how that could have happened. I don't know. It's garaged. Right, yeah. It's fucking, it's mint. That's all I thought. That just came out of the exhaust when I dropped it. Is that water? Water and mystery oil. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? Holy crap, dude. <laughs> get the get That's the uh the sand. Shit. Where's it? The sand? That? Yeah. <laughs> dude. Oil spill fixed. Oil spill is under control. <laughs> Take notes, BP. <laughs> All right. Let's see, if, let's see how much water we got. <laughs> oh, that's oh. the oil. 
Where's the no. oil? <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's in my mouth. Oh my god. god. <laughs> okay, it's, it's going, it's going. Oh my god. Dude, it's like icy too. Yeah. <laughs> I'm glad I didn't back in the ship first. <laughs> Look at it, it's ice water. <laughs> wow, dude. dude. Oh my god. That's wild. Oh, okay. This, dude, this engine is so dead. It's like insane. <laughs> <laughs> wow. I was laughing. It went like so far, dude. Yeah. I thought oil was supposed to sit on, no, was, oil sits on top of water, that's why all the water came out first. Yep. Oh, yeah. Nice, nice and clean. Trust us. Something happened. And now it's dead. Nah. What? I just changed that. And uh, that's getting hooked. Yeah, that, that's why you the transmission. No, I'm trying to. Let's <sighs> reel this baby in. Is that a, is that a uh, 50 pounder? About a 300 pounder. <laughs> Flounder? Tuna. That thing's a tuna, that thing's worth about 50 grams. Yeah, I don't know. I just pulled it up, I'm not gonna eat it. I'm just gonna sell it at the market. You know. <laughs> that boy's Look at this thing. Look at this. A little rusty. <sighs> I mean, hey man. Yeah, I and can't look wait. Look at all the water that came out, like, that's just on it. <laughs> Instead of oil coming out, we just got water everywhere. Yeah. I cannot wait to open that up and see what's inside. Broke. Carnage. Big dick. Right. Dick. I'm gonna lower it. Very nice. It smells like up guys in here. What's up guys? What's up fam? Back here, day three on the uh, E46 monster, monster build. Stock replacement. Stock. Yeah, but it's upgraded. Upgraded stock. Upgraded stock. All right, so this is the engine that we pulled out of my brother's E46. It was an automatic. It had like 160,000 miles on it. It's fucking clean as hell. It had oil leaks, but we fixed them. Here's a list of everything we've done to the engine so far. Oil pan gasket, valve cover gasket, all the little gaskets for the bolts and shit. Brand new oil filter housing, rear main seal, exhaust manifold gaskets. Okay, so for those of you who know and don't know, this is an intake manifold off of an M54. It's a fucking monstrosity. Look at this shit. To say the least. Okay? Yeah. It's got little holes for like idle control. It's got, look at the intake, the throttle body is down there. So when it's on, you can't even see the throttle body. It's just a piece, all right? The yeah. whole, is that the PCV system, the oil separator? Yeah, the oil separator. All that shit, okay. This is an intake manifold for an M50. <laughs> 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 what the fuck? Like, why would they go to that? Yeah. Anyway, for the M54, you can buy this kit from Seems Legit Garage. And all it is is this plate right here. 
and then it comes with these little bolt things to uh for the little holes that were for the idle control on that manifold there's holes right here that go into the intake thing valve and they give you six little set screws set, yeah set screws to put in all i did was heat up this and then just send them right send in send it in yeah they they <laughs> read it themselves so the the gold plate bolts onto the intake manifold and then depending on if you have a 30 or a 25 you tilt the throttle body from your old intake and you can put it on so it matches it up and i mean it's pretty simple you need like an extra gasket because there's two gaskets now mm. but that's it you have to extend the i don't know hopefully not I have no idea. We have, we have no idea what to do with all the vacuum shit. I doubt you'll have to, to be honest. We're gonna run a catch can yep. instead of the oil separator. This will go to a catch can. We're basically ready to put the engine in. Yeah. We just gotta put the transmission on. The tranny. And that's it. Yay. Yeah, as long as we get it even, it should be fine. Good. Okay, so we forgot the pilot bearing is in this one and we gotta put it in that one. I should have just bought a new one, but uh, yeah. we didn't, so we're gonna fill it with grease and see if we can get it out. Like the backing? Yeah. Attempt number two with wet paper towel. <laughs> Fuck a tool. No way. Alright, sick. God damn it. Shit, there's right up my ass. camera cut off at uh, <laughs> right as we we're putting the engine in but so everything's in all the accessories are on pretty much everything's plugged in there's a couple of vacuum lines we had to we still have to plug up or whatever and then we got to figure out what to do with this with the catch can and everything and then for the m50 manifold stuff that I didn't realize when I was saying stuff about it was this needs to be modded with a zip tie because that bolt back there doesn't line up um, the fuel rail you got to cut the little um, hold on there's one on the ground uh, there should be one on the ground oh these things there's four of these things you got to cut them off because they don't they hit the manifolds you got to cut those off and then the um what else oh yeah all the plugs for the injectors, the injectors need to be rotated 180 degrees so the plug is going that way, which isn't the way that these are, so they had to open this box and flip all the plugs and then close it back up. Kind of a pain in the ass, but that makes that fit. So this is like 
This is usually over here, I, I believe, yeah. or something. Uh, and then we made these clean fucking things to hold it on. We hope they're sealed. Not really sure, but um, yeah. I mean, that's it, right? I don't know. Everything's ready to go. We're gonna crank it. Yeah. I did the oil pump nut. I forgot to say that. Mm. The wire. Okay. Nope. Not yet. Oh, so much fuel just came out. What? Holy shit. Oh, really? Yeah, those injectors are not sealed. <clears throat> that one is, at least. We're learning. The front ones are. Yeah. The back three I bet you that bracket's like pulling it up or something. Stand by. Take six. Fuck. You fucking coot. Get the seven. Seven. <laughs> Probably still like air in the fuel system and shit. Yeah. I think it's just coming from the valve cover. Two huge chunks of ice. Okay. I wonder if your exhaust is full of ice. Okay, let's put coolant in it. How about that? Jesus Christ, dude, that can't be good. That's yeah, it's probably just shit. Maybe that the exhaust engine. was clogged. Like, with dude, ice. Dude, I, I think it actually is, dude, to be honest. 
Those, wow. look at those fucking things. Oh! <laughs> like, <laughs> what the fuck? That's very possible Dude, that that pipe is- Oh my god, the is... here is nuts. Alright, let's put coolant in it, because I, I feel like, I don't want to- it smells peppermint. You can smell peppermint. Oh, the Mr. Oil. <laughs> yeah, dude. Vaping fucking peppermint. It's all still in the exhaust. Clouds. It smells good. Clouds. All right. Now we got to fill her up. Right. Yeah, we're going to add coolant so we don't mess anything up. Uh, got to let it run. He still smell. <laughs> the biggest fucking foam. Oh, yeah. Hey, you want to check the ground for uh... stuff? It's pretty dry. All right, you ready? Ready. Let's see if she can hold it. <laughs> Sensor plugs were melted, but that was before too. Right. <coughs> Did you use all that gold tape? Just saying, the 0600 is ECU not communicating. Is it <laughs> is like fuck. <laughs> oh. <sh> <laughs> all right, pull them out quick before it settles. Because they, they actually slide right. Now. <laughs> Make sure there's nothing in the rails, like a fucking wrench or something. Oh, it's been so long. I feel like just <laughs> yesterday we're doing this. The same exact thing. Yeah. <laughs> oh, okay. Now, the brakes are mostly rust. Transmission, should I go through all... Okay, brakes work. <laughs> Oh, 
Where's reverse? <laughs> Haven't driven a fucking standard in a while, huh? <laughs> been a long time. Yeah. swapping the ECU because we think that this ECU is messed up because it's throwing code P0600 and online it says communication error or some shit for the ECU. Now last time when we started it before it was doing like kind of the same thing and we just switched the ECU and then we switched it back and it worked again. Yeah. So So this this is the one that was working. Yeah. This is the one that I didn't want because it wouldn't let me rev. Mm -hmm. Maybe a new engine, new rev. This was the one that went to that engine. Yeah. Okay. I guess we'll see. Coil pack was bad, causing a misfire. We had too much vacuum on the crankcase. So we opened the catch can to yeah, vent the atmosphere. So yeah, so that's just venting, and it seems fine right now. So give it another rip up. Gotta be the ECU. Well, yeah, let's put the hole in this one. Okay. Now, we're back on the other ECU. It's a big fucked up, big fucked up experiment. Yep. But, I mean, we did have a fucking coil pack that was not working. Better. Definitely. Yeah, 
that was like the biggest problem. Yeah, on that first cylinder since that was probably never firing. <laughs> Plug's probably fucking soaked. Dude, yeah, that did make a huge difference. Holy crap. Oh, fuck! <laughs> oh, man. Oh, hell yeah. Yeah, dude, this is normal. This is like it feels, normal yeah, it, yeah. It feels fucking good. Oh, dude. <laughs> I only got to experience this for one week when I had it. Yeah. Imagine putting that seat in here. I'll be so yeah. much lower, it'll feel so much faster. I, oh yeah, definitely, dude. Oh, look at all this salt. We can have it, yeah. Real great. <laughs> Get the fuck out of here. Oh my god. No! I avoided salt this whole time, and then for some reason, yeah, what are they preemptively this... fucking... Yeah. This is absurd. <laughs> dude, fucking low-end torque loss? Nah. Yeah, just, <laughs> just do it. All you need is a tune, and it'll get rid of that. Dude. No. What do you it makes get rid of what? The low end, like bot, like less low end. Dude, I'm, I was being sarcastic, dude. That's... I know, I know, but like still, it'll be even better. Yeah. If you tuned it for that manifold. Oh shit! Oh, uh, <laughs> damn, dude. Why did it turn red, you piece of Dude, shit? Dude, you know what else I just noticed? What? It doesn't really smell like burning oil as much now. <laughs> what? Just remember, you, your old engine used to smoke like crazy because the rings were fucking blown. <laughs>
when I die Make sure you spread my blood on a BMW And when I die Make sure you spread my blood on a BMW Microphone attached to my head so I can